Hey all, what's up? It's your girl Ariana, and you are in for another little techie video review. As you can see, my gaming setup is different from the usual pink that you see. I've gone with the red and black theme, nice, classy, and of course, very gamery. And the most exciting part about this is that everything I have here, the gears, the peripherals, are all from MSI. Y'all already know it's gonna be good because it is MSI, so let me give you the lowdown on what some of the latest peripherals and gears are and my recommendations. Plus, I'll be playing a little game and be sharing some promo with you guys, so stick around. The key to any good setup, of course, is to have a good chair. It helps you maintain good posture and helps you stay comfy as well. This is the MAG CH120 gaming chair. I love it because it has a complete steel frame support. It fully reclines back to 180 degrees. You can adjust the armrests and seats very easily. And it's just nice and smooth and silent and glides like butter on the floor. Especially with someone like me who sits around for a long time, my back tends to hurt. So having an ergonomic headdress, pillow, and lumbar cushion support is the best. For this MSI gaming gear, we have the MSI Force GC30 V2 gaming controller. So if you wanted to play any kind of game on your PC that requires a controller or that's just your preference and this one is really cool. It has a wireless dongle so you don't have to worry about any wires getting in your way. It's cross-platform so it's not just for your PC but it can be used for Android devices and other popular consoles. Best part is it also has haptic feedback so that your gaming experience is super enhanced. Here we have the MSI Immerse GH50 gaming headset. It's got surround sound and a vibration system and I love it because it can hook up to the RGB Mystic light and you can change up the color on the side. It has a sturdy metal construction and it is foldable as well and it has a detachable microphone. Best part for me are these ear cups. They are so comfy and the headset is nice and light so I can wear it for a long time. To all my fellow keyboard enthusiasts out there, this is the MSI Vigor GK50 Elite Gaming Keyboard. It's got kale blue switches, so if you're the type who likes clicky switches, this is for you. This mechanical keyboard has a high-low keycap design, so it reduces strain and pain of the hands and wrists, especially if you like to play for a long time. It looks really nice and elegant because it has a brushed metal top plate, and it's got really beautiful RGB lighting and lots of effects. This beautiful baby right here is the MSI Optics MAG274 QRF QD monitor. It's a 27 inch monitor with rapid IPS which provides an ultra fast 1 millisecond GTG response time. It's got a WQHD high resolution at 2560 by 1440. At 165 hertz high refresh rate, you can experience really smooth gaming, blazing fast refresh rate, and gives you the upper hand when you have to play fast moving games. It looks very classic and elegant in this whole setup, and I really, really love this monitor. It makes playing games so much easier and smoother, and I just enjoy a good game on a good monitor, and you can really tell the difference. Now check out this MSI Clutch GM41 Lightweight V2 Optical Mouse. It's got a little RGB dragon right on top that changes color. At only 65 grams, it is ultra light. You can securely hold the mouse in hand with its diamond patterned anti-slip on the side. It also uses the MSI friction-free cable so that you minimize friction on the desk. So it's pretty much like the wire isn't even there. One of my favorite parts of this whole setup is the MSI Immerse GV60 streaming mic. If you are looking to upgrade your setup and you really want that good audio quality for your streams, for podcasts, or just recording in general, then this is the mic for you. It's got high resolution digital audio and you can capture detail with a sample rate of 24 bit or 96 gigahertz. It's an all-in-one condenser microphone, so you can switch between pickup patterns depending on your situation. You can change it easily on the knob. What I love is that there are dedicated dials so you can adjust the volume for the microphone and headphones and a mic mute button. I love the stand that it comes with and it's so chic, but if you want, you can also mount it on a boom arm with built-in threading and a 3 meter USB cable and a pop filter with ease. You don't need to install additional drivers or software for this. The GV60 lets you plug and record straight away on any platform at any angle. And that's it for all my MSI gaming gear. Which one is your favorite and which one are you adding to cart next? So I'm here right now on the MSI website with their gear up and game on challenge. 
This actually features three of their products from their different series and lets you test out the peripherals so that you can see how well they work by being challenged by some games. So we're gonna try them out. Also, if you like the sound of this mic right here, then this is the MSI streaming mic. It sounds so nice and so good. But anyway, let's go and start. We have the Klepp series, the Immerse series, and the Vigor series. So let's start with this. So I love it because this is actually such a nice gaming mouse. It is lightweight at 74 grams, very accurate, and you can really game all day with its low latency. So the game that we'll be playing today is called Circuit Shutdown to put your accuracy to the test. And with this mouse, it should be easy peasy. I just have to keep the ball in the center of this lane and if I exit it, then I lose a life. So I must stay inside of the lines. But with this mouse, it actually makes it really nice and smooth and easy to navigate on this page. But maybe that's just for now because it's quite slow. This is like my pre-FPS training. But I like it. Since the mouse is nice and lightweight, I can really make more accurate movements and follow the circuits much easier. The music is also so intense. It's making me nervous! Oh, buddy. Oh my god, I am speed. I am a movement goddess. Mouse buff. Mouse buff. Oh my god. Oh. I did pretty good though. I got a score of 1,540 for circuit shutdown. Now there are two more games, and if I play all three games, I can enter the prize draw. So let's move on to the next world of Immerse. This is featuring the headset. It's super comfy also, and I can wear it all day. I love these cups. Now, this one will test our spatial awareness, and just by listening, we should be able to reach our goal. Now listening with this headset actually makes it really easy to play this game. All I have to do is listen to the sounds and I can hear if it's on my left or my right. Okay, I, I heard it. The way that I can hear like when the sound is like behind me is insane. Yeah, I love it. You can easily tell when the sound becomes louder as you approach it. So that if you're playing a game that requires very precise audio, this Immerse series is definitely for you. The fact that I can play this game with no visual cues and just using sound is crazy. But not bad, we got a score of 1,625. Our last game in our next world is from the Vigor series featuring their keyboard. It's a full RGB backlit keyboard. Now let's get started. This is Jungle Board. It's basically a rhythm game, but we will be pressing the correct keys in sequence to be able to score higher. And I think it gets faster the longer I play. So we just have to use our WASD keys and press it right when it gets into the box. It's perfect when I get it and it turns gold. But this is actually so cool to play. I love the music. But this keyboard makes it very easy to know when I'm clicking and it has very accurate like touch. So when I want it to be pressed, it's very accurate. This music is so hype. It's like, yeah. No loose streak for me today. We're in the zone. Okay, not gonna lie, it's getting a little bit tricky. I'm actually a rhythm goddess. Okay, I spoke too soon, but we did score super high on this game. We got a score of 5,140, so let's check my score for all three games. In total, I got 8,305 points, and if I share this, I get a chance to win $50 Steam wallet codes. But I loved how this game totally tested all my different things like precision, speed, stamina, reflexes, and performance, all through using these MSI peripherals, and they really did make it easier to play the game. And that was my Gear Up Game On gameplay. If you want to challenge yourself, then the link to play is in the description below. That's it for my review and gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you have any comments, suggestions, or 
just reactions on what you think of this whole MSI setup, then let me know in the comments. And don't forget guys, there are also two promos to watch out for. You have the MSI shout out promo that is until September 30, 2022. What it is is that you have to shout out or review an eligible MSI product and you'll get a chance to win a $20 Steam code. And secondly is the MSI meant for each other promo until July 31, 2022. All you have to do is take a quiz and have a chance to win a $20 Steam code. And that is it for my little MSI video, my review, my gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed everything if you want all the details for everything that i talked about in this video it is in the description and i will see you guys next time bye bye